Highlinies much easier this time. Um, so Bella was in the bed next to me and I honestly think the nurses were in a race to knock us out because our coping me mechanism is extreme sarcasm. Mm -hmm. And uh, I don't think the other two newbies were too appreciative of no, her coping mechanisms. One was on a, a partner treatment. He's here for a week. He's only having one hyperthermia. And Jan, the gentleman that I showed around and kind of talked through the hyperthermia, he was the other one. So they took the two boys back. Gentlemen, boys, what am I talking about? The gentleman back. And then Bella and I were the last ones to go in. Actually, I was the last one to go in. Because um, I had the same nurse as last time, Teresa. She is amazing. And um, Bella had, I believe her name is Anna. I'm not 100% sure, so I'll check on it. Um, Bella recovered remarkably. She was up at 6, had a phone call with James and Nicole. And, of course, everyone just hazed me as I was trying to sleep. Just picking on mommy, man coming home into the lion's den um and of course nicole was like no no can you make me sauce <laughs> it has been i don't even want to know what my house looks like i told them to hire a service to come clean before i get home because i will kill them kill them don't think i won't because i will because i especially my mother oh my god she runs a tight ship no one don't play Okay, um, have a big, big honking bump on the back of my head, and I only had a tiny one yesterday, and it hurts like a mother, oh my god, um, Bella had some pain meds for some heat paints, sorry, I'm seriously on my, like, fourth gown, it's ridiculous, um, uh, I was concerned that it would be harder for me the second time, and it wasn't. You know, um, this is the hour that I pretty much woke up the second time. Um, had a hard time forming words again, but not nearly as bad as the first time. Um, Bella, if you can see her, she's the glow of the iPad. Totally acting like a normal teen teenager, so, you know. Well, life is good. I still have a little bit of a trouble. I've been trying to wait, but it's getting dark, and I'm going to lose light here pretty quick. Um, so, second one down. A few days of, you know, more, I believe, antibiotics, energy infusions, um, things of that nature. Um, Bella will be inhaling two pieces of cake and a chocolate croissant tomorrow morning for breakfast, even though we're still supposed to be on a sugar-free diet. I don't care, it's my reward. I don't care. So, I will be having chocolate cookies for breakfast. That's what I'll be doing. Um, and some fruit. So, from Eibling, we are on the mend. Um, I still have to do the video of the supplement list and I will do that, I promise. Um, but I feel the therm coming into my future where I can just lay in the salt room and the zen room, the planetarian room. One of the other um, companions, um, Susan, her daughter Chloe here is being treated. I used her name. She said she didn't care. Um, she's been going over there to just try and kind of relax. and um, We can be awful. I mean, companions, be prepared. It sucks. Some of us get sticked five, six, seven, eight times in a week because our veins just blow up and collapse and they have to get a new vein and, you know, my little meltdown and then my hercs and it's, we can be hard. I mean, thankfully, my family, we tend to just get sarcastic and and laugh and say stupid shit and make fun of each other and um, and that's our coping mechanism which 
I, I personally feel is a lot better than just being, although Bella's temper tantrum last night was epic. No comment. It was really funny, actually. But she left the room to go shower, so it was okay. I think if she had stayed, it would have been, it would have gotten ugly. Um, <clears throat> so the worst thing right now is that we're, our stomachs are just like, we're just starving to death. And so we're just trying to drink a bunch of fluids. She doesn't sweat and I just, I'm dying here. Um, so for all of you, second time was better for us. I wish the that for both of you or for everyone who's coming. Um, I really do because it just, now we'll see what tomorrow looks like and we'll look, you know, I'll, I'll do the video and see what we look like. Um, but everyone seems to be doing okay from what I can see uh, from previous treats, second timers. So love and light, health and wellness, and definitely, definitely all of you two more steps for me because I'm stuck in this bed until tomorrow morning. All right. Thanks for all the great wishes. Thanks for all the, the love and, and, and the thoughts and all the great stuff that you guys have been sending me today. And Bella, it's so appreciated. I just can't even tell you how much we're just soaking it up and, and really, um, using it to our advantage using every single message of love to just really harness the positivity. And, um, and I thank you. I thank you from the bottom of my heart. And for those of you that are coming, expect messages from me. Paying it forward, people, it's important. So I don't even know what day it is in the States, to be honest. I think it's Thursday. So jacked up right now. So happy Thursday for all my bolder happy Thursday writers. Happy Thursday. So if any of you want to come to Boulder and experience a truly unique experience, you have to go on the Thursday night ride. It's very important. So good night to all of you. And I will see you on the flip side. Bye.